I'm Austin. And I'm Royce. And these are the, the No Work, Work News. News. Today, the... we'll start with some footage from Downtown okay. Boys in an interview with the band. <laughs> Hey, I'm Ben Katzman, and you're watching No Work TV with the Downtown Boys. <laughs> All right. So. What's our message? I think we like to talk a lot about this dissonance between what we want, what we dream about, and then what actually exists and what we're actually going through. And we try and really talk about what we're thinking about, what we're feeling about, what we're acting about in between those two things which tends to be a lot of stuff about, you know, anti-capitalism, fighting racism, thinking beyond gender. Yeah, trying to make freedom. You know what I mean? I'm kissing. Thinking about the police as perpetuators of racism. It's a weird place. There's a lot. I, we did this whole loop over this whole month of uh, not in the U.S. but parts of Canada, and Mexico, also. And it's, I don't know. It's like incomprehensible to think about the enormity of this country and the, the gravity of the history and the present and just how much different stuff, like physically, uh, you know, material stuff, is in this culture and in the landscape and in the country. I don't really have anything smart to say about it, but just like looping around in this kind of whirlwind we are in, that, in this tour, it's just kind of mind numbing. Yes! Thank you, Mary. <laughs> Open to anyone who wants to help us make another record. Yeah. We're looking for a bass player. Uh, writing songs, try and find that hot cover. Yeah, our, our songs have more of like a purple to them now, I think. I love Miami. Yeah. It's the greatest country I've ever been to. <laughs> wow, that was a really great interview, wasn't it? Yeah. Yeah, I'm, I'm really happy that they said they like Miami. It seems like most bands that come to Miami seem to really, really like Miami, which is awesome. That's because we know how to party! Everyone yeah, Miami! Miami. Kind of party. Yeah! Alright, well, o o Cinema in Miami Beach presents A Week with Woody Allen. A whole week. I don't know if I'd go to a whole week with Woody Allen. Yeah, man. I've heard some things from you guys. Yeah, what'd you hear, Royce? I don't know, you said she's... That he's like doing some weird shit with some people. Oh and yeah, he's married his stepdaughter. Stepdaughter. Yeah. That's not weird. That's not weird. Uh, <laughs> that's not that weird, honestly. Um, <laughs> the films they're playing is Eddie Hall, Crimes and Misdemeanors, Radio Days, Manhattan, and Hannah with the sis Hannah and her sisters. I've seen Manhattan and Eddie Hall, and they're both pretty good. So so. so Pretty good, and like good enough to go out. Yeah, yeah. I like Woody Allen movies. He's uh, he's he's an asshole. He's really funny. <laughs> well, what kind of? Yeah, he has to be an asshole. Uh, you guys told me he's like dating his stepdaughter. Yeah, we already spoke about that. Yeah, that's, that's <laughs> yeah. What a dick, right? <laughs> All right. So, what else is going on that night? Oh well, uh, it's not that night. After that, you're shit out of luck. If you don't want to see Woody Allen, then you just gotta wait till Tuesday. Tuesday. Oh, what's going on? Well, uh, Churchill's or something going on Tuesday night. Wow, what is it? It's good. It's good to know. I can go to Churchill's on Tuesday, like like last week. Let's see. Uh, a folks up evening, July edition. The lineup will be Uncle Scotchy, Aura, Victorious Eve, Demir, Lone Wolf, Home, and Mandy Lane. O M B. OMB. Lone Wolf OMB. OMB. What does OMB stand for? All my balls. <laughs> all right. No, wait. Oh, not all. All right. Well, I'm sure. I'm sure that that's not what it means. Okay. Let's see. What else is going on? Whoa. What else is going on this week? If you've got nothing to do on Tuesday and you don't feel like going to that show, then you might as well wait till Wednesday, because at Churchill's. There's going to be a punk show. Well, not punk show. I, don't, I actually don't know any of the other bands. <laughs> but um, my friend's band Inoculus is playing, and they're really good. Um, DNR is also playing with them. 
Eurasia, Voodoo Stew, and then DJ Skidmark is going to be spinning wax the whole time. And I like his playlist. He put the mixes really good music. Like what? Uh, like, I don't know. One time he bought one of our CDs at Kirby TV. One of the old ones, though. Yeah, no, so that, guy, that, that, guy's, that. that guy's the shit, man. He's, right. I remember him. Yeah, that's, gonna, that's at 9 p.m., and that's going to be $5. All right, so Tuesday, Boy Germs is going on. That's Thursday, actually. Man, who cares? <laughs> the people who are playing that night. Oh, my God, you're right. <laughs> oh, my God. Wow, I'm so sorry. This is the news. Okay, so Thursday, we'll have Boy Germs, a night of creative empowerment. Girl Germs Rock and Roll Edition, which happened, I think, a couple of weeks ago. Yeah. yeah. So I guess the bands playing that night would be uh, The Talking Dogs, The Done, <laughs> Lone Wolf, Lone Wolf, and Kid Lore. Yep. <laughs> On Friday. On uh, Friday. At Churchill's. It's 8 p.m. and it's five dollars. It's going to be a '90s flashback fest. Which means that uh, they're going to be playing, it seems like it's going to be a lot of uh, musical acts, so I think it's like DJs and bands playing and stuff like that. Fuck the 90s. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sure the 90s are okay. <laughs> what do you remember I from the 90s? 90s? If you're a true 90s kid, come out to Churchill's on Friday at 8pm for $5. Because you're going to get to see a bunch of cool 90s shit going on, and there's going to be a costume contest. There's gonna be a bunch of people walking around everywhere, and if you win the costume contest, you win a hundred dollars. Then you're gonna dress up as Adam Sandler. You I'm said? gonna dress up as Adam Sandler. What should I dress up as? You should dress up as Little Nicky. Yeah. Little <laughs> <laughs> brother, give me in the face on a shower. <laughs> that didn't come out. Ch of Chucky. Oh yeah, we're Chucky. Yeah, a lot of good horror I'm films. I'm too tall to be up. Chucky, man. It can be uh, Brian Chucky. The Brian Chucky. <laughs> nah. You're gonna be a big Chucky. Chuck. <laughs> <laughs> you can be um, you can be Clifford, the big red dog. The big red dog. I got my hair red and be Clifford. Clifford the big red dick. Spin your whole body red. <laughs> okay. Um, okay. also going on, if uh, you don't wanna go to the nineties show, you can go you can go to Gramps. At 10 p.m. and it's only three dollars. There's three bands playing. Like Roy said earlier, it's a dollar per band. I mean, who's playing that night, Roy? Um, looks like Chaucer, Tailings, and Hypoluxo. It's a pretty cool lineup. You should go, or you could go see Party Fly. Yeah. What he's and, talking and about? Else. It's a, a show at Poor House in Fort Lauderdale. It's right next to Revolution and that uh, Children's Science Museum. It starts at 9, and it's Party Flag, The Gun Hose, and Warm Like Winter, who are from Orlando. Sounds like a really fun show. Uh, you should try and make it out to that, if you're not going to the other two shows. And um, what's happening on Saturday, boys? Uh, looks like there's a show, and looks like Modern Age will be returning to Churchill's. Looks like Psychics will be playing with them, Deaf Poets, Million Young, and Chris will be playing as well. Yeah, Chris with a K. Chris. Chris. There should be an extra P. Okay, no, there should be an extra K. <laughs> All right, right now we're doing something called a double shout out. So we got to both shout out at the same time, right? One, two, three. <laughs> shout, shout out to Nun Hex. They start their international tour in Argentina, which is super cool. They'll also be playing in Chile. They will be. Accompanied by Odioso Dios, which is a power violence band from Argentina. So they'll hopefully be making them feel nice and at home, even though they're home. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Four of them are from Argentina. So it's pretty cool. It's really cool. Yeah. What, uh, what else? Do you have any closing notes, Royce? Um, go uh, see Inoculus. Miami Girls Rock Camp <laughs> will be... Happening, in, we'll about happening. Five, in about five seconds on your computer screen, we will be presenting to you live footage of their awesome grand finale, which concert. was on a few days Friday, ago. Saturday. It was on Thursday. It was on Wednesday. <laughs> it was on Sunday. It was on. <laughs> it was on Sunday, and. Um, 
And the whole idea was to get a big group of girls together and start playing in bands, and the bands played that night, and they were all really young, and it was cool to see young people kicking ass on stage, so here's the footage. Do better than us.